Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Calculator Techniques. In this video guys, we will discuss indefinite integral, which an integral without lower limit and upper limit and also called antiderivative of a function. So now we will proceed to example number one. Evaluate the integral of x over 4 plus x squared to the power of 3 over 2. So what we are going to do here guys is we will assume the value of our x and we will substitute directly to the given equation and we will do differential equation from choices and which choices having the same equivalent value from the given equation are uh, is the right answer okay so we will proceed uh, let us assume our x is 0 0.1 near to 0 then uh, fraction button alpha x over open parenthesis 4 plus alpha x x squared close parenthesis x to the power of uh, fraction button then 3 move your cursor down then 2 then calculate x is 0 0.1 then press equal okay guys the answer is 0 0.012 so we will save this value to our memory shift store a okay the answer from the traces guys is letter a we will uh, immediately i uh, will directly uh, check letter a okay so we will di differentiate uh, traces a so shift D, d over dx then fraction button negative 1 over square root of 4 plus alpha x x squared then move your cursor to the value of x then enter point 1 then press equal okay see as you can see here guys the answer is 0 0.012 we will divide to recall a see the answer is 1 so guys we can conclude that the answer is letter a the integral of uh, x over 4 plus x squared over 3 over 2 is equal to negative 1 divided by 4 by square root of 4 plus x squared okay guys so we will proceed to example number two find y is equal to f of x if dy over dx is equal to 8.60 x to the power of 1.15 so the same steps guys we will assume our x is equal to 0 0.1 and then we will directly substitute to this given equation and then we will differentiate uh, equation from choices and we will compare the answer which choices having the same value from the given equation okay so dy over dx so 8 8.60 alpha x to the power of 1.15 then press calculate the value of x is 0.1 then press equal See guys 0 0.608 so we will save this value store a okay guys now the answer from the traces is letter c we will directly check letter c if it is right or correct then shift dy dx then 4 alpha x x to the power of 2.15 one five then move your cursor to the value of x then enter point one then press equal okay guys the answer is zero point six zero eight we will compare divided by recall a so the answer is one it means that same value divided by the same value is uh, two values divided by the same value is equal to 1 okay guys so we will proceed to example number 3 
um, example number three guys it has a trigonometric function integral of sine to the cube x cosine to the fourth x dx so it is in trigonometric function so guys just remember that when any equation having trigonometric equation and you are solving for integral calculation then your calculator must be in region mode so shift mode and then four okay guys this time we will assume our x is equal to 0 0.3 any values if it depends upon you on how convenient you are during a calculation for this example we will use 0 0.3 so guys the same step we will uh, direct substitute our x to this equation the given equation so we are already in radian mode uh, sine alpha x close parenthesis then x to the power of 3 then move your cursor down then cosine alpha x close parenthesis then x to the power of 4 then calculate enter value of x point 3 then press equal this the answer is 0 0.02 so we will save this value to memory a okay so now guys the right answer is letter b from the choices we will directly check letter b so we will demonstrate i uh, don't know no, we will differentiate letter b equation okay uh, shift i'm sorry shift d over dx then fraction button 1 over 7 then move your cursor cosine alpha x close then x to the power of 7 then move your cursor minus a fraction button 1 move your cursor down then 5 then move your cursor cosine then alpha x close parenthesis then x to the power of 5 then move your cursor going to the value of x enter point 3 then press equal yes the answer is 0 0.021 which is equal to the given equation so okay guys the answer is the right answer is letter b now we will proceed to example number four uh, last example for this video okay example number four example number four integral of x squared dx divided by square root of one minus x to the power of six same step guys we will assume the value of x is equal to point three okay so now um, we will calculate we will substitute the value of x from the given equation so fraction button alpha x x squared over square root of 1 minus alpha x to the power of 6 then calculate the value of x is point 3 then point 3 then press equal okay guys the answer is 0 0.09 so now we will check letter c which is the right answer okay we will differentiate letter c shift d over dx then fraction button 1 over 3 then move your cursor then shift inverse sign then alpha x then x to the power of 3 then move your cursor close parenthesis then move your cursor going to the value of x then enter point 3 then press equal so it is the same by the same guys so the answer is letter c letter c has the right answer same value from the given example so that's all for um, indefinite integral guys and thank you for watching see you for the next video 
with multiple integration okay thank you